Hello, another cool function we support in MediaCAD is our live subtitle editor. What editor does is that you can view and compare your newly created subtitle file with the subtitle file you have uploaded in order to create the edited subtitle file. To show you what I mean, let's try out the editor on our sync. Let's select the sync task we have created and click on the task detail page and click open in editor button. Now your media and subtitle file will carry across to the subtitle editor. The editor launches and you are presented with the media asset you supply plus the resulting subtitle file after the sync task was completed. The editor is largely composed of three sections. The first section on the left is the display section of your uploaded media file. And to the right of that, you can see two subtitle sections. The subtitle section on the left is read only subtitle section. So you can view your original subtitle and the subtitle section on the right is subtitle section that you can edit. And the bottom section is your timeline. Let's try to edit the subtitle. After editing the subtitle, you can submit the edit by clicking on the submit button. Also, you can export the edited file from the screen by choosing the menu icon on the top right and click on the file and click export. This is how you use the subtitle editor from Scene. Now let's go to the translation section and try the subtitle editor there. We can edit the subtitle file after it has been translated as well. Let's select the translate task we have created and click on the task detail page. We can edit the subtitle file after it has been translated as well. Let's select the translate task we have created and click on the task detail page. And same with Scene, click on the open in editor button. Editor UI for translation can be largely divided into two sections. The first section on the left is the original subtitle file that you have uploaded when creating a translation task. And the second section on the right, you can see the translated subtitle that is the output of the translation task. The original subtitle on the left is read only, while the translated subtitle on the right can be manually edited. After making some changes, if needed, you can submit the edit by clicking on the submit button and you can export the edited subtitle file from the screen by choosing the menu icon on the top right and click on the file and click export. This is how you use the subtitle editor from Translate. And this is how you use our live subtitle editor for sync and translate. Thank you.